evolving threats require a new approach. Over the last few decades, our national defense strategy focused largely on counterterrorism. Now we are once again facing a great power competition with near-peer adversaries, requiring a different approach. Our adversaries have been rapidly enhancing their offensive capabilities with new technologies, such as hypersonic missiles, projectiles that can fly long distances at more than five times the speed of sound. Beyond hypersonics, the battlefield has evolved. Threats have increased in quantity. For instance, our troops face swarms of drones. Threats have also increased in lethality. For example, highly maneuverable cruise missiles and intercontinental ballistic missiles. To combat these new threats, the United States has mobilized to quickly test and deploy novel solutions to modernize the battlefield. Dynetics is a key player in the U.S. weapons modernization priorities, including directed energy, hypersonics, and the enduring indirect fires protection capability. We will be delivering these capabilities by 2024. The battlefield is continually changing. Today's warfighter faces unique challenges. From a proliferation of hostile unmanned aerial systems or drones, as well as rockets, artillery, and mortars. These high volume, low cost threats require a different approach to ensure the safety of our troops. Directed energy weapons are different from conventional kinetic weapon systems in that they employ highly focused energy, such as lasers, to damage their targets rather than traditional ammunition. From short range air defense systems to high power microwave solutions, the Army is building a layered defense to protect its critical assets in the field. Directed energy weapons are a key part of the solution. Dynetics is building the indirect fire protection capability, high energy laser, or if the cow, a 300 kilowatt class laser that will protect fixed and semi-fixed sites from hostile UAS, rotary and fixed wing aircraft, as well as rockets, artillery, and mortars. Dynetics was awarded a contract to design, build, and integrate the laser weapon system onto an Army medium tactical vehicle platform and conduct field testing at White Sands Missile Range in New Mexico. As the prime contractor, Dynetics is responsible for final assembly, integration, and testing of the system. In 2020, we transitioned our highly capable system from the 100 kilowatt class to the 300 kilowatt class. This weapon provides several operational advantages, such as inexpensive cost per shot, fast and accurate utilization with a broad range and deep magazine, and limited collateral damage. In addition to delivering directed energy solutions, Dynetics is paving the way for multiple hypersonics efforts. The hypersonics threat is very real. Our adversaries have been working diligently to enhance their offensive capabilities with new technologies such as hypersonic missiles, weapons that can fly long distances at more than five times the speed of sound. Highly maneuverable and operating at varying altitudes, these hypersonic systems can exceed the detection capabilities of existing ballistic missile defense systems. These systems are a force multiplier, providing a critical niche capability to supplement our conventional offensive strike operations, particularly as our adversaries increase their own capabilities. Dynetics is a key player in the hypersonics effort. We are working on two hypersonics programs led by the Army Hypersonic Project Office, part of the Army Rapid Capabilities and Critical Technologies Office. The common hypersonic glide body is a key component of the U.S.'s hypersonic strategy. The U.S. Army and U.S. Navy have partnered to execute hypersonics through the use of a common hypersonic glide body, as well as a common missile design and joint testing. Dynetics is producing glide body prototypes to support this joint services hypersonic partnership. We are collaborating with Sandia National Laboratories for the production of the hypersonic glide body. Our engineers have been working side by side with Sandia to learn as we transition this capability to industry. In addition, Dynetics is the production agent for the Hypersonic Thermal Protection System, or TPS, which will shield critical system elements of the glide body from the extreme environments of hypersonic flight. This contract transfers the TPS supplier base from government to industry, allowing for the expansion of advanced material development and providing room for growth in present applications and future concepts. Dynetics has also made key contributions to the development of the Long Range Hypersonic Weapon, or LRHW. This program is introducing a new class of ultra-fast, maneuverable, long-range missiles that can launch from ground platforms. 
The OR-HW prototype includes the new common hypersonic glide body, an existing refurbished trailer and truck to be modified as a new launcher, and an existing Army command and control system. Dynetics was selected by Lockheed Martin to be a part of the LRHW Systems Integration Contract, developing launchers in hydraulics, outriggers, power generation, and distribution for the ground platform, as well as providing flight tests and training support. Five launchers were delivered in late 2021, and Dianetics continues to support the fielding of these launchers. LRHW battery fielding will deliver residual combat capability to soldiers by the end of fiscal year 2023. In addition to delivering solutions in the field of hypersonics, Dynetics is innovating to broaden the U.S. indirect fire protection capability. Over the last several decades, the U.S. has developed numerous aerial defense solutions to protect critical military infrastructure, creating systems that can intercept and eliminate incoming threats before they reach their targets. For instance, the Patriot Air and Missile Defense System protects against smaller, lower altitude weapons, while the Terminal High Altitude Area Defense System, or THAAD, is designed to combat higher flying, medium range missiles. However, for a number of years, the U.S. Army has been seeking an interim short range air defense system to bridge the gap between Patriot and THAAD. Unlike its predecessors, this system must be more mobile in order to protect critical fixed or semi-fixed assets. Dynetics' own Enduring Shield is the chosen solution. Enduring Shield is a mobile, ground-based weapon system designed to acquire, track, engage, and defeat unmanned aircraft systems, cruise missiles, and rockets, artillery, and mortars. Derived from Dynetics technology and modified around previous Army science and technology programs, Enduring Shield is capable of firing a range of missiles while providing current and future growth capabilities. In creating Enduring Shield, Dynetics redesigned the launcher to refine its capabilities making it both more efficient and less complex. The system offers a 360 degree envelope with the ability to engage multiple targets simultaneously. It can be fully integrated with the Army's integrated air and missile defense battle command system and offers both cyber resiliency and electronic warfare protections. We are building these systems today so we can prepare to deliver more to the Army. Evolving threats require a new approach. From directed energy to hypersonics, to enduring IFPIC, Dynetics is a key player in the U.S. weapons modernization strategy. We are committed to rapidly delivering state-of-the-art, innovative capabilities to support our customers' programs and protect our nation's warfighters so they can come home safely to their families. Dynetics, designing and building for the future, right now.